What would happen if we actually decided to change? If we used the Bible. If we used the Bible. The Bible. To help us with everyday situations. Our friends, our music, our families. Is there any topic the Bible doesn't cover? This. 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 This is iTopics. Have you ever been to a candy shop and you think you're just going to walk away with one piece? But then after you try it, it's so delicious you walk out with five bags? Even though people tell us it's not that good for us, we don't care. It's great. That's kind of how our words are. We think that we're just going to tell a little bit of lie or a little bitty gossip, but then we get out of control and we just can't stop. You know, in James 3, 4, it says, and a small rudder makes a huge ship turn wherever the pilot chooses to go, even though the winds are strong. In the same way, the tongue is a small thing that makes grand speeches, but a tiny spark can set a great forest on fire. Our words have so much power in them. Sometimes we think we're just telling a little lie or a little gossip, and then it ruins a whole friendship or someone's life. So next time you're deciding whether or not you want to talk about someone, try not to gossip. After all, in Proverbs 16, 24, it says that kind words are like honey, sweet to the soul and healthy for the body.